So, um, John, thank you very much for joining us in this uh, executive training. Um, from what you were telling us this morning, actually, it seems that awareness of discrimination on racial, ethnic, religious ground, etc., was really very low only 20 years ago, but has significantly risen, to you know, in recent years. How is that? Is there was there um, what were the main factors that drove this awareness raising? I think certainly in the early 1990s, if you went to EU conferences, you got this regular idea from. Um, government or trade union or employer representative that there's not really a problem of discrimination here. And I think from the mid-1990s onwards, there were a lot of EU um, initiatives to try to raise awareness. There was uh, research funded, there were conferences, there was the European Year Against Racism, and most importantly, there were things like the founding of the uh, EUMC, the European Monitoring Centre of Racism and Xenophobia, and all the research that produced and, of course, most importantly, the, the two equality directives. And I think slowly the research that was uh, produced by these bodies, the cases that came forward because of the law, and generally uh, awareness began to change. You couldn't, you couldn't kind of see it at the time, but if you, if you look back ten years, you could see the change happening. Yeah. And I think that was you know, part of the reason why. Mm. 